You're good. All right, I'm David Hughes with Rock Ridge Trees, and we did a video a while back about grafting a tree, and I wanted to show you what happens after the fact. Here we've got one. This is a gaffer tree. It was grafted about the same time as the one we did the video on, which was a Kansa. And you can see now we've got all this little growth coming on here. This is the rootstock growth. You can see it's a different color. The, this is the bud growing from the grafted tree. This was done two weeks ago, two weeks ago today. So I'm going to pull all this stuff off. This is all of the all of the growth. One of the things you want to watch for on these is sometimes these these dormant buds will come up inside the parafilm and they'll push that graft off. You don't want that to happen. So now we're going to look over here at a major tree that was grafted about a month ago, a month and a half ago maybe. You can see the growth. You can see the growth all the way up here. This has been since March. This has grown well since April actually. This is June now. We've had about two months growth. We've got about two feet of growth on this graft. Right now we're going to take the rubber bands off. I'll take a knife, I'll cut the rubber bands, cut the parafilm lightly. Cut the rubber bands at the bottom. All of that can come off now. This is all healed in. If you look there at the joint there where that's healed in, you'll see a nice even amount of growth around each side where that graft was done. The next thing we do once we've done this is we take our shears and we very carefully pick a spot right here above the graft union and we take that rootstock off right there. Cut your parafilm so that you don't take your new graft off. And then we'll also, right here where the, where the stub of the graft comes up above there, we'll cut that off right there at an angle. And that'll make a nice, that'll heal nicely and you'll have a good even junction right there. The next thing we'll do, and I don't have the stuff here with me to do it right now, is we'll put a stake up and we'll tie this new growth to a stake. That way a bird won't land on it and break all this out. This is still a, a tender spot in the tree right here where all this has grown together. And that is the results of grafting a pecan tree. I'm David Hughes with Rockbridge Trees and I thank you for watching this video.